One, two, three, go! Welcome to another edition of At The Game, fueled by G-Series. I'm Casey Littlejohn, back in the Tacoma Dome for another year of championship football here in Washington State. A battle of undefeated teams today, always fun to watch. It's the 1A semifinal between the Meridian Trojans and the Cascade Christian Cougars. Cascade Christian looking to make it back to the championship game for the third consecutive year. Maybe this will be the year that they get over the hump. Meridian won the title in 2006. I'm sure they would like to recall those successes and take home another trophy this year in 2010. So it's Meridian and Cascade Christian getting ready to kick off. Let's get you to the action on America's source for high school sports, maxpreps.com. Cascade Christian players filled me in on a ritual they do before every game. Hey, I'm Derek Simpson, Cascade Christian High School. I'm Axel Johnson, Cascade Christian High School. Hey, before the game, we always had butt. Cascade Christian caps a long touchdown drive with a five-yard touchdown run by Colton Faverty. Tate Slesk for Meridian is able to hold on to this pass despite the hit by Axel Johnson. Second quarter, Cascade Christian up 7-0 and defensive back Axel Johnson again comes in, separates the receiver from the ball. Cougars with the ball and quarterback Kyle Stennis finds Tyler Walrath out of the backfield. He gets to the edge, makes some dancing along the sideline, cuts it back, and he is gone. Flies into the end zone for a touchdown for Cascade Christian. 14-0 Cougars. Trojans trying to get something going on offense as quarterback Zach Celeste finds Mitchell Strick for a first down. CC with the ball back, and Stennis floats one over the top for tight end Joshua Schreffler. Big gainer for the Cougs. Trojan lineman Tim Whitney gets his sack on, throwing Stennis to the ground, helping prevent any more damage in the first half. But check out this nice catch here by Cascade Christian Jr. Jake Archer, dragging his toes on the sideline for the catch. Fantastic technique by Archer. That would have been good in the pros. Second half now, Meridian trying to probe that Cascade Christian defense. But it's number 12, Kyle Crawford coming up with the INT. It was a tough day for the Trojans on offense as Brendan Osman and company shut it down. Bizarre play here is Tim Whitney gonna pick the fluttering ball out of midair for Meridian. Giving the Trojans a chance. So things not going well for Slesk and the Trojans for the air, so he's gonna take his chances with his legs, and he does well on this pickup. Meridian unable to score though, Cascade gets the ball back. Tyler Walrath gets the handoff, and he breaks loose for a big run. Keeping the clock moving, this time it's Osman taking the handoff for the Cougars, keeping the chains moving. Here Walrath finds the hole, taking the Cougars closer to a third touchdown. Walrath a little banged up on the play, but that's okay, because they got Brendan Osman who's gonna take the sweep pass and send us out of the backfield. He's going to just will his way into the end zone. Cascade Christian, 21-0. Cougar fans come to their feet as they root for a fourth down stop late in the game to cinch this one up. And they're going to do a little bit better than that as Kyle Archer comes up with the interception. Gets down on the ground. Cougars take over. 
Now late in the game, Cascade Christian does make a mistake as Tate Slesk intercepts the ill-advised pass here, giving Meridian the ball in great field position. But down three touchdowns in the fourth quarter was a little bit too much to overcome as Cascade Christian punches their ticket to their third straight 1A title game, a 21-0 victory over the Meridian Trojans. All right, here with Axel Johnson of the Cascade Christian Cougars. Uh, shout out today, Axel. You had some big hits on defense. Uh, what was it like out there? Um, it was. It wasn't that bad. We prepared all week, and we know it's gonna be. A, it's gonna be a good iron match. Hard hitting football. That's how we play. All right, you guys get another shot at getting that state title this year. What's it gonna take to get it done? Uh, hard work and determination, because we have bitter taste for the last two years in our mouths right now, especially as seniors. Hey, it's a great accomplishment. Make it to the Dome three years in a row, so good luck next week. Axel Johnson, the Cougars, going to give it a go. They get it done today over Meridian 21-0 in the 1A semifinal. Thanks for watching At The Game, fueled by T-Series. Make sure to stay tuned for some more playoff football, boys basketball, girls basketball, even some wrestling next month. I'm Casey Littlejohn signing off from the T-Dome. See you next time.